Hey everybody and welcome back to Mesh Control for a quick tips video. This video we're talking about adding fixtures to a keyframe shape. You can add or remove fixtures to a keyframe shape after you have built it by using the add slash remove fixture button in the effect editor. You can also do this after you recorded it by using the include function first. See our video on include for more in-depth information on it. You can also edit the group's layout and fixture order from this menu. So let's have a look at that. Here we are on version 15 of Titan with the Titan Go interface. So if I was to go ahead and say we'll uh, select our BMFLs and we'll go to Shapes and Effects, Keyframe Shapes, Create, and let's see here, we'll go to our position and we'll just touch them a little bit here and then Add Frame and we'll tilt them up. And add Frame and then Finish Recording Frames. And then we'll go in our plus, select a new layer, and we'll go to our intensity, put our dimmer at zero, add frame, there's a dimmer at full, add frame, and then finish recording frames, and we'll set everything to a snap. And we'll go ahead and put our full version up, uh, capture up so we can see it. So we see here we've got just a basic flyout going. And the same, we wanted to add some new fixtures in. So we go to hit the add or remove fixture button here. And our soft keys, we can select add or remove fixtures. And we'll go ahead and add our spiders in. And then hit exit. We now see that our spiders, which are in red, are doing the same keyframe. And then if we wanted to, we go ahead and record and save that to a playback. And we'll go ahead and clear our programmer out and exit out of our keyframe shape. Let's say we wanted to remove the fixtures from this recorded keyframe shape. So what we do is go and use our include to include it, then open our effect editor and choose our add or remove fixture buttons again, add or remove fixtures, and then we'll click on our spiders, then remove group. And if we go back to our effect editor, and as we can see in our visualizer, the spiders are now gone. If we wanted to remove just some fixtures, we can go ahead and go to our Add or Remove Fixture button again, and then Add or Remove Fixtures. And say we want to remove this whole back row of BMF blades, we can simply select it, and then Remove Fixtures. And we can see that those back row of BMFLs are no longer in our keyframe shape. If we wanted to edit our group's layout or its fixture order, we can again go and click this button, and then choose Edit Group, and which one we want to edit. And then we need to do is fixture order or and do its layout and edit the layout in our layout editor. So that is how to add or remove fixtures to a keyframe shape. I hope you learned something. Join us on Facebook at Avalites US. Join us here next time. Please subscribe. Thanks. Bye. We'll stop. Roger, we'll stop, Discovery. Welcome back. A great ending to the new beginning.